Um, I don't know. Um, wasn't able to get the obviously get the outs um, and keep guys off base. And I think he tried to get in there a little bit and drive the ball in. I think the first inning it seemed like he left some balls not quite getting in there. And, you know, they made some adjustments towards him. Yeah. You know, it looked like they stayed out with the play a little bit with him. Um, they did a nice job of, you know, making adjustments. The four stolen bases, I mean, what was he, what was he doing wrong there? Well, we'll look at that. Obviously, that's probably something that they've picked up something. Uh, so, you know, well, I think it's something that we will look at. Uh, you know, tomorrow I'll get on video and see if we're seeing any changes or any differences. Um, and then we just work, you know, work through that. Yeah, so validating, did you, did you think his stuff was crisp or was it just not his night? Or? No, I mean, I, you know, it's hard to, to say. If he's getting outs, you're saying his stuff's really good. And if he's getting hit a little bit, you're saying his stuff's not as good. So I, I can't really say that. Um, but they did, you know, obviously they were, you know, better with him today than they were in Milwaukee. And so you have to give him some credit for making that adjustment. Um, you know. And, and then we just we, we march on. We look at it and make sure he's, you know, making adjustments too. We see, you know, I don't know if we see these, he sees these guys again this year, but um, something you got to continually improve and, and move forward. And that's pretty common, I guess, when a team sees another team pitcher for the second time in that shortest span, that they make adjustments. I mean, would anything that you could pick out that they might have done differently, change their lineup otherwise? Uh, I think they're probably looking, you know, once you've seen a, seen a guy once, you get a chance to see how he pitches. Uh, and you try to, you know, you're a little more, a little better to anticipate kind of what's, not necessarily what's coming, but basically how a guy pitches. And you've seen it live. Uh, so, I, you know, you, they change the lineup a little bit. Uh, so, again, it's hard to, to say exactly what adjustments they're making. Or if he didn't get to the ball at the same spots that he got him to the other day, and uh, so it didn't work out. Yeah, so overall, your team played a lot cleaner. You know, this is you know, yeah. One of those to forget. You know, I, I thought the one the run that hurt us the most was that one. Um, you know, they get the three and and make it four two. We get a chance to get out of that inning right there if we just do what we're supposed to do uh, with a zero. And at that point, we're, we're at 4-2, and you feel like you can get back into the thing, and then they drop another three on us the next inning. And at that point, you're in, a, you're in a drive, basically, to not have to use people you don't want to use. You know, you're, you're behind in a game, and you hope you can get back in it. Um, but the guys that come in the game are going to have to throw zeros for you because you're not going to try to, you know, use your, the guys you're using every day almost to, you know, with the lead. To try to get back in the game, there your the guys' arena is going to have to throw zeros. Wit's going to throw zeros. Uh, unless we, and if we can creep back in it, then we got a shot. But you know, we weren't able to do anything at that point. And that that next three hurts, but I thought that one hurt us more than than anything because it you know pushed it to five two. But it more than anything, it was just the momentum of that. Uh, 